Join us on May 6th at RT and Judy Lagarde's farm auction. You'll be able to buy this John Deere 310SG and we are gonna be selling the remaining farm equipment and farm supplies belonging to the Lagards here off of Burnland Turnpike, Route 287 here uh, in the Wheatland area, but Hillsborough address and plan to buy at this auction in a live in-person format. We will have two auctioneers selling the entire sale. And we will also have about 250 lots available for online bidding, but the majority of this sale will be in-person, on-site bidding only. Again, this is Saturday, May 6th. The auction's gonna start at nine o'clock sharp. We'll put a link with this video as well. We'll be selling the household items for Mr. and Mrs. Lagarde on Thursday. That's gonna be a virtual auction. So it'll be a live cry sale, but no on-site bidding for that auction. So everything that you see here is gonna be sold. This represents a, a lifetime collection of farm supplies and working farm equipment and tools belonging to Mr. Lagarde. And I can't say this enough, the guys that we've had doing the auction setup for this, Tony, Mr. Danner, James Davis, Ike Swart, and the rest of the crew, Mr. Lagarde as well, just done a top rate job at sorting these items. A lot of these items are gonna be sold by the pallet. Of course, you've got cylinders, some electric fencing, chargers, you've got grinding wheel, got some milk separators, a number of wheels, there's a chain hair back there, American wire. Again, there's, a, there's gonna be a, a ton in this sale and I'm gonna give you a kind of cursory overview of what we have to sell here. Because we're not gonna be able to catalog every single item for this auction. Uh, you will have a chance to buy a very large amount of angle iron, scrap metal lumber. This is some good quality uh, lumber here. here as well a cart I could sell that skid steer <laughs> and try to give you as best an overview as I can of all the items that we'll have in this sale vintage GE refrigerator uh, some good old doors crate shipping crate Let's go inside this building. Again, this is going to be on May 6, 2023 at 9 o'clock in the morning. And you thought you saw a lot already. Everything you see in here will be sold as well. And I'll go up and down these rows. This building goes on a, a long way. We've got some saddles. Some Western saddles. Massey Harris. And Minneapolis Moline Advertising. Bet you haven't seen one of these before. This is an egg crate maker. Everything that you're seeing here will be offered with online bidding. The first, I think we have the first 270 some lots for this sale you'll be able to bid online for. But, but truly, if you can make it out to this auction and uh, bid in person, it, it really is gonna be something that you wanna see, you're gonna wanna be a part of. Uh, these bags are hard to come by. That's Loudon Milling Company there in Hamilton. And you just don't see a lot of this anymore. This is, these old Loudon County farm estates are becoming fewer and far between and, and we'll be selling another one here for the Lagards. Lovettsville Fire Department, Middleburg Fire Department items. A lot of uh, vintage kitchen items, farm items, again, seed bags. Some saddle frames there. Uh, large collection here of sad irons, gas-powered irons. 
here on this table as well. Just a huge collection of them. Go back to showing you through these uh, through these table lots. I would I would take a picture of all this, <laughs> each of these individual items. There's a powder horn right there. That's neat. Olsen crates. I take a picture of all this, but like a video is more effective at just showing you the quantity of what's here, and, and you really have to pick through these lots. We'll say that uh, Ike and Craig and Lisa and Marie have they've they've cataloged. Uh, we're going to catalog this whole sale, so at least you'll be able to see what's in the lots. Even though we just, because of the size of the sale and it being on site, we just can't provide online bidding for every single item. Here's these gas powered self heating irons, more sad irons. But you don't see these very often. These are lots 255 and 256. One of these was made in Winchester, Virginia. I uh, have some Lionel trains. It's an old radio flyer wagon back there. Here's another. <coughs> Excuse me. Lovely pollen we've got here today. Another vintage uh, refrigerator. It's almost like a, some sort of a churn. Like I think it's a cradle churn. Two-hole corn sheller. Neat item there. We've got some cross-cut saws. <laughs> and here's some more vintage feed bag, feed sacks. Again, we will catalog this entire sale. So it'll be pre-cataloged. You'll have a pretty good idea of what's going to be offered in every lot. But as I mentioned, most of this... Most of this entire auction is only going to be in-person bidding. RT and Judy Lagarde have lived at this farm for, I think I was told, 40 or 50 years. And there's just a huge collection here of items that there's a wrench collection there that you just can't find a lot of these items you're just not going to be able to find anywhere else and you're definitely not going to find them anywhere else in this kind of quantity some harness horse tack bridles chicken crates chicken crates chicken crates if you got poultry or fowl, we've got a crate for them in this sale. That picture right there just shows old estate auction. Pretty neat. Some hunting, bow hunting supplies. Here's some organizers, hardware organizers and crates. Just look at all that. Again, this is going to be Saturday, May 6th. This is Loudoun County, Virginia. This is a, a Hillsborough address. It's really the Wheatland area of Loudoun County between Hillsboro and Lovettsville. We'll have a food, we'll have food uh, provider, a food vendor on site. So you'll be able to get a couple meals out here. But bring a truck, bring a trailer. It's going to be an auction that you're, you won't forget. That is for certain. Look at all these vintage bicycles. Look at all of them. Here is some advertising. Ice skate palette, drum set. Magazines, Tonka truck. 
parts organizer. And we've also have some farm machinery that we're gonna be selling as well. So let's walk down here to where we have the farm machinery parked. So we have uh, two auctioneers running on May 6th. A number of gates. Two auctioneers selling on May 6th. We will, again, be selling the household and personal property on Thursday, May 4th. And that's gonna be a four o'clock p.m. virtual auction. Woods mower, missing one of the sections of it. The gearbox does turn. There's Ike Schwartz truck, that's not in the sale. Got a New Holland round baler that uh, is a one owner for Mr. Lagarde. John Deere tractor and a loader. And then here's an item. This is a 1926 Rumbly oil pull tractor. Now this was run in the last year. 1926 model, a nice piece of antique farm machinery. other antique tractors here as well and then here's some even more farm supplies there's a gumball machine more horse harness tools hardware Again, more lumber. Some pretty thick cut lumber here. And then we've got some more hardware. Uh, let me get a good place where I can show you here. We've got some pot belly stoves, windows, doors, steak body sides, windows, vintage doors, trusses, some concrete, Garden items, a bird bath, and a bench. Again, all the farm machinery you'll be able to buy in person and online. We have online bidding for that. I think that starts all your equipment and then these vehicles, pickup trucks. I've got a Honda Accord over there. I'll walk over and show you. A Honda Accord, Buick Rendezvous, Chevy S10 pickup, F250. So again, this is the farm auction for RT and Judy Lagarde. This is going to be on Saturday, May 6th. There will be some online bidding for the first 270 some lots. Most of it is going to be in-person bidding only. Check out our website, damewoodauctioneers.com. Just click the link with this video. We'll take you right to the catalog. We can't wait to see you out here on Saturday, May 6th.